Hi guys, good morning. Welcome to my channel Indra Art. My name is Gretchen and I like to pour. It's my first video and I'm kind of nervous. So let's do this step by step. Today I'm going to show you a flower dip. I made this one last week. It looks kind of dark, but I still have to varnish it. So the colors are going to come out very more bright. I'm going to show you my paint colors. I mixed titanium white, primary yellow, soft pink, and I mix the same color, the hot pink, with the soft pink to get like a medium pinkish color. My silver, crimson red, phalo green, and this is two parts black and one part phalo blue to get like a very dark night sky bluish color. Next week I'm going to show you my consistency and how I mix my paints. I mix my paints with one part Floetrol to one part, two part paint, two parts paint. But I'll come to that next time. Let me show you my tools for a flower dip. I have already put down two glass panels which I'll be pouring on. I have taped the back. So when my fingers are dirty, it doesn't give prints on the back. I'll be using my torch. One of the most important things when you are pouring, you'll see it later. My tweezer. Whenever anything goes in, you want to get it out before it sticks to your paint. Don't forget the level. That's the most important thing, I think. Don't forget to put it leveled or else your paint is, paint is going to run off your, off your canvas or in my part, the glass. You're also going to need towel paper. This is to do the dip. I'll show you later, but I'll be making the flower dip wet with just a little bit of water.
Let me show you the dips. I'm liking this one better. Not sure if I like the middle, but I do love it. This is more like a floating flower. I don't know what you think about that one. Let me know in your comments what you think of the paintings, please. If you do try to remake one of these paintings, please leave the picture in my comments. And maybe I will share your creation in my next video. So if you like this video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. I'll be making them with you. Thank you for watching my video. See you next time.